Boy, I just got off the phone with customer service on the 800 Home Depot line. I have a customer who ordered oh, about $5,000 worth of material from Home Depot and then called back and tried to put it onto my Pro Rewards account because I'm a contractor. And they said they can't do that. Then they split the delivery into two different delivery dates, send me the wrong material first that I can't use until the first material gets there. So now they put me behind by another day or two. They give me a 12 hour window to deliver. When they deliver, they tell me material can only be put curbside. And we instructed them originally that it had to go to the sub-level parking. No pallet jack. The driver was courteous enough to bring it to the gate of the building. Would not go in any further because the forklift wouldn't fit any further. Understandable. I'm sure had they tossed him 20 bucks, he would have brought it in if the equipment he brought out was capable of doing so. so. Then I call up the customer service and try to explain to him that I would like to talk to a district manager. The Santa Monica store screwed up. They're giving us a hard time. My customers call the 800 number. They're giving him a hard time. I call the 800 number. I'm getting a hard time. And they won't give me a supervisor's name. They won't give me any of the district manager's names. They won't even leave a message for the district manager. Now, do you call that good customer service? I call that very poor customer service. And I'm half to cancel the orders, have them pick them up on their expense, and switch all my business over to Lowe's. Very, very, very disappointed with Home Depot. And I've been dealing with them for quite a while now, probably close to 30 years. I spend approximately $1,000 a week. That's $52,000 a year. Most people don't even make that kind of money. And that's what I'm spending on material. And that doesn't include the stuff that doesn't go on my pro rewards, like this nice five to $10,000 order. Pissed, way pissed. Thanks for listening.